Peppers. Well, I don't have any big COVID related news, except that I am also worried about Spain, France and Portugal of how things are developing there. But I guess I'm using this video as an excuse to wear this new Marseille jersey, as I said in my Twitter post 20, 25 years ago, I would not have believed that I would ever have a Marseille jersey. I was still sour from their a win over Milan in the 93 Champions League for league final. But yeah, I used this as, as an excuse to show off this jersey for the first time on my channel and to look a little bit at what's coming this weekend in those three countries. Again, due to COVID, I am worried. You know, we have already partial lockdown in, in, in Madrid. There will be stuff and these leagues also don't really have a contingency plan yet. In La Liga, we have, last time I did the video, we didn't know when the, uh, what games will be played when uh, and now they have done it for the next two rounds, which gives us for this weekend, you know, we get a lot of the big boys, all of the big boys we get on Saturday, Sevilla at one at Granada, then at four, Atletico Madrid against Celta Vigo, interesting one, but there's other games that I'm more interested in, Real Madrid against Cadiz. And then Getafe Barcelona, so three of them away from home. Uh, we have also the Derby de la Comunidad between Villarreal and Valencia. And we have Real Betis against the Real Sociedad, which I also think is not a uh, boring game at all. But I want to also look one week ahead because we get the big one. Saturday, 24th of October at 4 o'clock, Barcelona against Real Madrid. Market in your calendars. This will probably be one of the more interesting classicals because none of the teams are really in great shape. But yeah, I think it is wide open to me, and I'm very curious to see where this one will go. Let's move to uh, France, where this weekend we have Marseille play against Bordeaux. So, coincidentally, the two jerseys um, that I just bought uh, recently. Uh, we have a Breton tower between Nord and Brest, and we have Lille against the Racing Club de Lens, which is a northern duel. PSG is playing at Nîmes, so also interesting. And Rennes at Dijon is a, is a win that they should get. And also Portugal, we have where they will play next. The big one, Sporting against Porto. Uh, Saturday at 9.30, I think that's a pretty big matchup. Um, although, you know, as of late, I think it is very much Porto dominated, uh, but Porto had a recent loss, so I find that interesting. Rio Ave against Benfica, mm -hmm. that could be interesting as well. And then we also have rescheduled from the first round, but that's then uh, a little bit later, but I just wanted to mention it. Sporting, thanks to Lask, is not playing in Europe, so they can play Wednesdays against Gilles Vicente and make up that game. So we'll see it everything even out. Well, that was it from me. Let me know how you liked uh, the scheduling. As I said, a little classical is looming. What games will you be watching this weekend? Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel for see more. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that would be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. With that, I wish you a wonderful day. Bye. Thank you.